Democrats are voting to impeach President Donald Trump for beating the ever-loving snot out of Hillary Clinton. <clears throat> I mean, um, for committing a crime. Yeah, that's it. A dirty, dirty crime. What was the crime again? Oh, we, we don't, we don't remember. Oh, okay. Democrats in the House are voting to impeach President Donald Trump, and they've got a whole lot of reasons why. None of which have much to do with any crimes that he has supposedly committed, of course, but see, you're not supposed to actually care about that. Because according to Adam Schiff, impeaching Trump is simply the right thing to do because he cheated in the last election. The argument, why don't you just wait, amounts to this. Why don't you just let him cheat in one more election? Why not let him cheat just one more time? Why not let him have foreign help just one more time? That is what that argument amounts to. AOC gave the game away, saying that it's to prevent a potentially disastrous outcome in 2020. We also need to move quite quickly because we're talking about the potential compromise of the 2020 elections. And so this is not just about something that has occurred. This is about preventing a potentially disastrous outcome from occurring next year. And some excuses were super weird. Lucy McBath, a freshman congresswoman from Georgia, blamed her son's murder seven years ago for why she supports impeachment. Jordan was sitting in the back seat of a car with his friends at a gas station. A man pulled up next to their car and complained about the loud music that they were playing. He pulled out a gun and fired 10 shots into, into their car, hitting Jordan three times and killing my only son. I made a promise to my community that I would act. I promised that I would take that sense of protection, that love a mother has for her son, and I would use it for my community. Huh? I mean, don't get me wrong. I am so, so sorry that Congresswoman McBath's son was shot to death. That is horrible. And I am terribly sorry for her loss, but as tragic as that is, what the heck does it have to do with whether or not Trump committed a crime and is deserving of impeachment? The last time I checked, an IG report just came out basically accusing the FBI of using false pretenses to spy on American citizens and lying about it. And apparently that's no big deal. But Trump supposedly committed such an atrocious crime that he should be removed from an office, a crime so heinous, so despicable, in fact, that Democrats seem to be having an awfully hard time articulating it. So allow me. Democrats are voting to impeach President Trump because he committed the unforgivable crime of beating the tar out of Hillary Clinton at the ballot box, and they are absolutely terrified that he will be reelected next November. And if we the people, who are supposed to be in charge of picking our own president, thank you very much, are going to get dragged through months of political theater over their three-year-old butt hurt, let's at least be honest about what's happening here, because it has got absolutely nothing to do with Ukraine. And that's your Reality Check America. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube page, like us on Facebook and Twitter, and stay sane out there.